Well, that might be gone. This one's being sold and he upgraded to a Camry. All of my four wheel drive worries might be gone so soon. I love it. Look at this thing. It's just a, a neat old person Camry. And just like that, it is sold. It is out of here. It is no longer my problem. Then I just gotta do that one. Yeah, me too. The old wheel spin. Alrighty, so with the rodeo gone, um, I have a yard to clean up and do maintenance on because I mean weeds everywhere I've got this here and I pulled that giant stump out of there because we want to flatten all this out and put garden and everything like that so um, the rest of that soil is going to go in this hole here and just fill it in make it nice and level or as level as I can and yeah so, it's hot out here. I don't, I don't want to have to do it, but that's life. you got to reset and get ready to get back into it again because I've been neglecting the yard for a little bit now, so time to get on it. Alright, so obviously I don't really have that much to make up a full video. Um, so, I'm going to show you all my Hot Wheels because I just added some more as well. So. This one here, oop, that one there, one of my favourites, it's a Decatora. I love the R390 from Gran Turismo. Uh, someone I went to school with had one of these Civics and I fell in love with them because, of course, um, this is like the Drift Falcon RTR sort of style. I mean, I always love that 69 Mustang. Um, those Shelby Daytonas, also another sister car of one of my favourites, which is the Ford GT40. Um, I've got the two AE86s. Um, I do want more of them because, of course, um, the EB110, one of my favourite drift cars. Uh, you got to have the K truck because why not? Um, this one was given to me by a customer when I worked at Repco um, because it's got HKS, and they gave it to me after they saw that I had HKS stuff hanging on my wall. They thought it was cool and they wanted to share. Um, and then the R33 because Skyline stuff. Um, I always love this shape of RX-7 in the police livery. It looks kind of cool. Then you've got the, uh, the, not Shakatan, um, uh, the other, the other one. I can't remember the name of the style. I think it looks really cool, but yeah. Um, the Dodge Challenger Demon. Not the biggest fan of that car, but like it was kind of cool. Um, it was definitely a step away from previous generations, so I kind of like it for that. Um, the Aston Martin Vantage, one of my favorite drift cars in uh, Forza 3, because uh, nobody drifted the GT Cup cars. Um, AG Civic, I always thought they were cool. Uh, I'd never owned one, but I always thought they were cool. Liberty Walk, got to have the Liberty Walk. Um, that just looked cool. I thought that was a cool looking car, so I grabbed that. Uh, Escort, everyone loves a Mark II Escort. Um, uh, C10, like the C10s, um, they're a cool looking truck. Um, this one was just recently given to me by a friend that is the, like, the, the Liberty Walk style fun ones. Anyway, it, it looks kind of cool. Um, and then we've got the GT40. It's not my favorite livery, um, but 
I, one of my favorite cars ever and then you've got the Firebird I I just thought it was a cool looking car um, then another one of that car I thought it was even cooler in the red I saw it in the red afterwards I was like that's even better um, and then the RX3 love the RX3 totally underrated although in Australia kind of not we had something similar called the Capella um, which basically the same but it was a four cylinder on a rotary um, 400Z I liked them when they came out I'm kind of underwhelmed by them a little bit but I really do like the design of them the Barracuda I think it's Barracuda uh, it might be just a GTX I can't remember um, but yeah cool looking car um, that's basically the new version of the other one um, the 787D from Mad Mike that is really cool um, I, I don't know why I just really enjoy that style um, Miata because Miata um, another one so I've got the white police one of same person who gave me that one gave me that one which yeah thank you um, I always love the low rider style this is kind of cool this is very Gran Turismo 2 90s racing around Laguna Seca I loved it um, that one same as the black car this was the same model Toyota Trago that uh, I, I got as my first car like uh, my parents had it and they gave it to me and yeah I always loved that shape ever since um, then you've got the CRX I, I just like CRX's I think they're cool and then you've got an actual 787B not the 787D 787B um, and then you've got the Audi which again Audi's were really cool rally cars um, and then we have the Porsche Carrera now I got the yellow one because it reminds me of the roof um, and they were always calling Gran Turismo um, and then my sister got me this set when they were a massive craze my mum got that for me that's an A86 it does the has tail lights, headlights, everything they do pop up you can open the doors and the suspension seems to work so yeah I thought that was cool so it's there um, I got these from D's Garage they did originally have uh, pudding in them obviously I ate the pudding because I'm not going to let pudding go to waste um, that obviously I've got one of those I thought that was cool um, we saw a video about these ones um, I got the HKS towel while I was in Japan um, I got the up garage one I got a few of them while I was in Japan uh, the tech arts one we obviously know about these C spanners I got from when I was working at Repco they were there and I was like that's cool as and then these two I got while I was in Japan but yeah I intend on filling this wall out at least to here with uh, the, the Hot Wheels maybe a little bit more maybe not don't know um, and then street carnage across the window there and then I've got this one which is a print I found while I was in Japan so I, uh, I had to have that one as well so yeah that's uh, some of the stuff I also have initial D manga um, uh, FC game home it's got like 88 games on it and this is all my Japanese language learning stuff um, I've got just a few small books and um, in there in that little shoebox uh, one of my friends who first started teaching me Japanese um, she made me little um, flashcards sort of of all the hiragana so I could learn that um, I do have some more stuff here as well um, like a couple of magazines and stuff but um, this is my Pikachu coin box put a coin on there there yeah that's uh sort of my collection it's getting there it's getting there